Hello there, and welcome back to the Manic Malamar. You with me, your host Adam, back with another video, continuing on our series of the Paldea Evolved Master Collection Completion. What part this is, I can't remember. It's hard to remember, you know, what I've uploaded, what I haven't uploaded, what I've edited, what I've not edited, what I've recorded, what I've not, I, I can't remember, but this is part, insert number here, I guess, of, of this series. This time round, we've got 36, here they all are, 36 sleeved booster packs, ones you pick up in your check lane. And what I've done, I've gone ahead and I've sorted them already into our pack arts. Because I want to see which of our boys are going to come through for us today. But unfortunately, <laughs> it's going to be Quackleval, I know that because this is all a Quackleval. Two Skeledurge, you know, just a small handful of Meowscarada and three uh, Shen Pows and a few Ting Lu's. Like, Quackleval is going to come, we know that's going to come through for us, but numbers are on their side. Numbers are on their side, but anyways, look at it all. We got a bit to get through this video. So why don't we just get to it, hey? Why don't we just get to it? Let me put these off on the side. And we're gonna start with me, Oscarada. Oh, come on, there we go. Pack number one. Are we getting first pack magic? Or will you get first pack magic with a code card? Nackley, Foy Coco and Watchroll, Tinker Tink, Calamina Snowy Mountain, Corva Squire, Artisan, Reverse Honch Crow, Love Disc, and we've just got a regular old spirit room. Here's your code card. Alright, pack number two. So are we gonna get more hits with sleeved boosters? Booster packs, then a booster box. Generally a bit of an expensive way. You know what? Oh, what do we got? We've got a crocodile. I was about to say, we're just gonna get straight into it. We've got a crocodile. There we go. We need that one. That's a great pickup. Oh, um, and I'm forgetting that I'm separating my reverse hollows from my non-hollows and my hollows over off to the side. But there's our crocodile. And there's your code card. So, um, what was I saying? It's generally a more expensive way to buy booster packs to try and complete your set. Um, however, it wasn't too bad. They just happened to be on special. So they were a little bit cheaper, a couple of bucks cheaper per pack. So I thought, you know what? I'm going to give this one a go. Let's go straight to reverses. And a Lycan Rock EX. There we go. Another hit. Three packs in. Hopefully you get a hit from that one too. I've got my fingers and toes crossed for you all. Let me know. What are you getting? What are you getting? Especially from that uh, Booster Bundle video. Please tell me if you got something. Because that was horrible pulls on my behalf, so hopefully the code cards came through for you. All right, where are we going? We're going a Lavatar, Flamigo, and a Hariyama. Nothing from that one. Hopefully you get something from that one. But now look, it's going all right so far. We've got two hits out of, how many packs? All right, lost count already. Lost count. Oh, and I've been doing a fair bit of um, research at the back end too, just just trying to find some some product uh, that I can that I can pick up next. But it's been really hard to find some stuff to to, to pick up so I can open. Ooh, that one set really high in the in the sleeve um, because there's uh, there is some more like different product. There is some more product around. I mean, we haven't, we still haven't done that um, Build and Battle Stadium yet. That one's been a hard one to find in stock. 
really hard one to find in stock. Um, but the other things that are that are missing uh, are things like um, the single pack check lane blisters. There is no one locally in Australia that I can find that actually has them. They're all like in the states or something like that. It's it's been really hard to to find some some of those products. Or well, we're having we're on a bit of a back foot here. Oh, I'm putting my reverses in the, in the wrong pile. We're on a bit of a back foot here. Um, we got one more Meowscarada, and we're into our Skeledurges. But yeah, those those single pack check lanes like. I can't find, and I want them because they've got the Smolith promo, like the, I think it's a Galaxy foil, and the Growlithe Galaxy as well. They've got those promos in them too. And yeah, they're hard to find. Uh, look, we've got another pack, no hits. All right. Meowscarada, oh, do I brain fart right then? We went blank. Meowscarada. Didn't really have much for us. A couple of hits, yeah, cool, that's fine, but not enough for the amount of packs we had. Let's see what our Skeledurge packs might come. Hey, hey, there we, oh yes, oh yes, oh yes. Now that is, my friends, that is, that's a hit. This is a off-centered, uh, but this is a good hit. This is a great card, fantastic artwork. Absolutely love it. Absolutely love it. There's your code card. Have fun with that one while I grab a sleeve. Oh, let's sleeve up that bad boy. Love that one. So glad I pulled that one. Love the art. Always have loved the artwork. I've been in. I like, I like Tita. I like Tita. Good design. Very Godzilla ish. Very Godzilla ish. Of that. Oh, here we go. Skeledurge, my friend, you have come through. Two packs in a row, two hits. Maybe as a uh, percentage of um, hits to pack ratio, Skeledurge is going to be our boy. There you are. Enjoy that one, my friends, while I again sleeve up yet another hit. Now, we're on to our Quackleballs. We are probably going to see Quackleball come through with the most amount of hits, but it's not going to hit that Skeleturge ratio. Not even close. All right. Hey. Oh yeah, there it is. Nope. Swing and a miss that time round. Swing and a miss. What about number two? Maybe, uh, maybe Shen Pao should come through for us, you know. Shen Pao's my boy. I love me a bit of Shen Pao. Especially that secret art. Special. I did it again. Special art rare. Love that special art rare. All right, another swing and a miss with Quackleville number two. Hopefully this isn't a sign of things to come. Because I think almost half, if not at least half of the packs that we got there are Quackleveil packs. I hope we don't swing and a miss on all of them. Bang, bang. Yep, there we go. No swing. I mean, <laughs> that was a swing and not a miss. Love it. Full Art Clodzire EX. What a great pull that one is. What a great pull. Everyone loves a bit of Clodzire. I mean, I'm not. Not massive, not massive, but not bad. I just love that they can design them on that just like gets such a, a good fan base, gets people excited. You know, not everyone likes a bit of Wags on. They do. Alright. Swing and a miss again on that one. But you know what? We can't win them all, can we? What are we up to? Five. Five hits, and we're not quite halfway through, so, hey, look, we could have those booster box ratios. We could completely flop, I mean, <laughs> just go back to that booster bundle video. That was a flop. But we could hit as well. 
He could hit too. So another swing and a miss there. Or, you know, swing and a miss. I say that swing and a miss is, you know, it's cricket term or it's a baseball term. No, I'm not I'm not a fan of cricket or baseball. I'm, a, I'm an AFL kind of guy. I love my AFL. That so could be uh, what we say is across the face. Out on the full. But uh, you won't all get that one. You won't all get that one. But boy, so you watch, uh, watch a bit of AFL and the terms the commentators use. Innuendos. Innuendos all game long. Oh, uh, come on. What have we got? <laughs> hey! Two clod size. We're ticking those boxes, we're checking off the list. And yeah, we got two clods eyes. I don't think there was a uh, gold clods eye in the set, wasn't there? I think so. So at this point, it looks like uh, we might have all the clods eyes. That'll be a great, great win to tick off all the clods eyes from one pack. Alrighty. Bang, bang, and what do we got? What do we got? Pikachu EX, which we already have that one. That's a cool one to pull. I do like that Pikachu EX. It's a great, it's a great card, great design. Looks really good. Fortunately, it's not a high value card, so it's not gonna hold much in terms of uh, trade fodder, but, uh, oh well, it is what it is. A pull's a pull, isn't it, at the end of the day? A pull is a pull. We're getting close to, well, it must be about halfway now. What have we got there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So, we're into the second half. First pack of the second half. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, we're tracking along quite well. Reverse, reverse, hollow. Swing and a miss on that one again. After I just said, you know, for me, being an AFL fan, it's across the face or out of bounds. It, I still say swing and a miss. I think it's uh, one of those sayings that's really sort of ingrained into uh, into the old uh, noggin up here. Uh, come on, can we come through with something? No, we don't get anything. Across the face. For those of you who don't know uh, the term across the face when, um, when playing AFL, refers to when a player lines up to take a shot at goal, and completely misses everything. No goal, no behind. Goes out on the full, across the face of all the all the sticks they're aiming for. So there's there's four sticks, two in the middle, two on the outer edge. You get the ball between the two in the middle, you score six points. If it goes in either of the ones on either side, you get what's called a behind, and it's only one point. So when it says across the face, it means we missed every single one of those. Didn't even get a point. Didn't even get a point. But AFL is my jam. Love it. And especially this season, the team's starting to pick up the game a little bit. If you really want to know, I uh, support the Adelaide Cross. <laughs> so it's a pull. We'll take it. It's a pull. It's a duplicate, but we'll take it. It's a pull. That one could be, could be good for trades because uh, because it's a full art. We might be able to trade for something decent. There we go. We're up to what is it? Eight now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. So we're uh, we're on the way. We're on the way to oh, getting close to. Uh, Hitting those, hey, there we go. We've got another one. Nine now, so we probably should be able to. Sorry, I was just trying to juggle those cards to see if I had anything else uh, in that pack. We're getting close to our knocking off the, uh, the pull ratios from our booster box. So that's a nice one up there. There's your code card. Get a sleeve for this bad boy. I'm a Sprigatito fan. 
my Ascarada fan. And my fan of the middle Evo. Uh, eh. Either the Pokemon's gotta be cute, adorable, or it's gotta be just really cool. Or just, you know, especially in the starters. The best design, in my opinion, in the starters. No pull from that one, just a regular old hollow Pormop. What does it say we're up to now? Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So we could definitely hit booster box rates, booster box rates, but I. Oh, this one's got a weird amount of sticky on the uh, on that tab on the back there. That was a weird pack to open. Very weird pack to open. Let's get straight to reverse, reverse, and Lux Ray. Uh, what was I saying? Can't remember. What's my train of thought already? Oh well, doesn't matter. We'll keep moving on. This is our last Clockwell pack before we move into our Chi Yu's. Oh, that's another one that's, there you go. Randomly just hard to pull that tab up. Oh, 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 that was a bit stuck. It's a bit tight around the base there. Reverse, reverse, and Harry Armor. All right, falling behind now. Falling behind now, team. All right. Shen Pao. Did I see Chi Yu before? Okay. Sometimes I get them mixed up a little bit. Shen Pao, what have you got for us? Ah, that one felt better. What have you got in store for us today, Shen Pao? Oh, we've got something. <laughs> yes. Now that, that makes up. Shen Pao, you are my friend. I love you. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, that is really well centered, too. Really well centered. Let's just get this code card out of the way. Oh, really well centered. Edges look. Yeah, the edges look really good, too. Let's uh, do a little bit of whitening across the top there. A little bit. Oh. oh, we all know what's happening with the waifu cards at the moment. You know, hold on to, for long enough. Get it graded, the value. Um, you know, we look, look at the Lily card. Yeah, is it worth it? Should I do it? I've got some other cards that you know, I think I should probably maybe send off for grading. Um, but the value of them isn't quite high enough. Maybe if I hold on to them for long enough, maybe it will be. Oh, what have we got here? Oh, Shen Pao. Oh, love it. Love it. Now, I like Annihilate. I think Annihilate is a fantastic, fantastic mon, fantastic design. I love the, the, uh, the evolution mechanics. And I think I've mentioned it before. I love purple. Love me a bit of grey. I'm a very earthy tone kind of neutral kind of person. Neutral. Really much of a compliment for myself. But that has some cool colours on it. Really like that. Man, we're getting some good pulls now. We're getting some good pulls now. What are we up to? Was it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven. We kind of hit the uh, the lowest end of the booster box pull rate, and we've still got one, two, three, four, five, six. This is the seventh last pack, so we can still pull another two to three. Oh, have we got something, or is it just a, it's just a hollow? <laughs> I was going to say. I was gonna say, if that had something else, there was gonna be a clean up on all three. Certainly was gonna be a clean up on all three. Cause that would have been, that, if, if that was another, that would have been three for three from Shen Pao. And Shen Pao would have walked away with it because um, Scalar Dirge was, well, it's two for two, but 
lower tier two. Lower tier two. Oh, lights turned off. What have we got? King Lu EX. Not something we're looking for, unfortunately, but uh, a hit's a hit. We've got to take it. A hit's a hit. Sleeve it up. We're running out of room over here. We have to uh, move all these across. I'll slide this one in over there. There we go. All right. What is this? Uh, one, two, three, four. Fifth to last pack. Fifth to last pack. Let's get rid of some of the rubbish I've left here on the, on the bench. And I haven't been keeping an eye on how well centered the cards are to frame, so uh, apologize if it's been bad. Sort of been getting a little bit carried away with getting through all of these all of these packs as you know as quickly as I possibly can. Going okay time-wise, I'm pretty happy with uh, with that. You know, I've had a couple of instances where I've stopped for a little little chat, have a look at a couple of cards. All right, have we got a hit? Oh, we've got something. We've got something, ladies and gentlemen. It's a Fletchinder, and you know what? I love the Fletchinder line. I think it's great. And we've got a loser. So that pack was not much of a loser. There you go. That was really bad. That was really bad joke. It's the dad in me. It's coming out. I apologize. I apologize. Well, I'm watching the uh, unsubs coming in now. Although, hard to get them to sub in the first place at the moment. <laughs> I don't want to lose any subs. I don't have many of you to hold on to right now. So please don't go. I promise I'll do better next time. I'll try. I'll try. All right. Swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. Always get uh, a little bit... Uh, Excited when I see that that hollow border. Even though you know every single pack's got it, I think it was just something that was. Oh, I opened a lot of XY packs early days, and just seeing that edge. Oh, mm. now that's an edge you can't mistake. That is an edge you can't mistake. I'd love to see a different gold card. I'm not a fan of the gold tools. Give me a gold Pokemon. A gold legendary, please and thank you. But hey, it's a gold card. And I will take what I can get. Especially because <laughs> the whole point of the series is completing master sets, so. It's a bare necessity. All right, this is our last pack. What are we thinking? We're gonna get some last pack magic. Are we? Fingers crossed. I don't think so, ladies and gentlemen. I don't think so. But not a bad way to end, to be fair. I'm not speaking of the Gary. Speaking of the goal. Second to last pack gets a goal. That is pretty good. What do we got? Three. Six. Nine. Twelve. Four, is that right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Fourteen. Hey, that's not bad. Not to mention that we got a gold. We got a full art. We got another full art. We got another full art. Oh, I knocked them all over. I was trying to be so careful. But we also pulled that special illustration rare Iono. What a vit... Like, honestly, I really debated with myself whether I'm going to go and pick up some of these cards today. And I've had a busy day. I've driven almost halfway across the state for work. And I went, no, no, no. You can spend 20 minutes dropping into the, the, the local Westfields and picking up some cards. And I had to go to three different stores to get enough for our booster box worth. But it was worth it. It was worth it. And the last place I went to, 
actually had enough packs for a booster box. I just didn't go there. Um, I just didn't go there, but you know what? I made the right call. I made the right call. Sometimes, just don't doubt yourself. Just, just go with the flow. Whew, what a, what a, wow, wow. All right, so, we've done the pulls. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna quickly just flick over to the binder. So let me just, well, I mean, for you, it's gonna be instantaneous. For me, I've gotta go through all of this bulk, sort it out, and figure out what's gonna go in the binder. So, I will be right back with you very shortly. All right, here we are, ladies and gentlemen, we're back. We've got our binder. It was pretty quick on my end because I remembered that I don't have to sort through all of my non-hollows because I think I've got every single one of those, but we're gonna double check as we go through to make sure we got those. So I only had to go through the reverse hollows um, and the full, uh, all the um, well, EXs and all that that we got, all those good hits. I knew which ones we needed and which we didn't need it anyway, so that was fine. Uh, we did get a handful of stuff to help uh, knock off some of those cards from our list. Uh, we're gonna start with skipping grass altogether and heading into our fire section because the first one we picked up is the Crocolaw EX. Then we're gonna move over to our Satyphon, but while we do that, let's just make sure we've got our non-hollow, non-hollow. What was that one? I can't remember, but I, I don't think that was... Oh, it's just the reverse of the jump off, that's fine. Non-holo, that's fine. We got that. We got the non-holos over here, and that one and that one. Yeah, that's all good. So um, then we start with uh, non-holo, non. Yeah, that, that's fine because that should be a reverse of that one. One, two, three, four. That's fine. And this one here will be uh, reverse for the low kick, so that's all good. And then you've got the non-holos there. That's all good. We got non holo, non holo, Wochi Yen. Yep, no, nah, that's all good. Yeah, look, I th I'm pretty sure, like, I'm pretty safe to say that we do have all the non holos. I'm pretty certain that's the case. Like, every time I go through the binder to do some updates, I think that's what I notice. Uh, anyway, our next card is going to be our reverse Sir Titan. And then we also have the reverse of the Velooza, too. And I reckon, I reckon. I think I've stumbled across a little bit of something uh, that almost looks like it makes a bit of sense. Um, reverse Luxray is the next one. And I've just reached the two cards that actually kind of... And, and it wasn't just these two cards, there was more. These these two cards that I have to put in next give me a little bit of a, an inkling as to why oh, I think the way I think. Because we picked up our Reverse Wigglytuff, okay? We haven't pulled one of those yet. But I also picked up a reverse Sandy Gast. They weren't the only ones we pulled. I actually pulled two of each. And this, these weren't the only two cards. There were some reverses within these packs that we opened that I actually pulled multiple of in this one video. Tinker Tink. This Tinker Tink is another one, because I've got more of those down there as well. Uh, I also picked up that Tink a ton. Um, I can't remember every single card. Uh, what are we at? 117. So we're over here to our Rock Ruff. I've got a feeling that some of these cards may only be available through certain products. You know, certain iterations of a card. Not exactly the card itself. Like, we've pulled a Hollow Garganical through multiple different products, and I pulled more in this one as well, but no reverses. Uh, Clodzire. Clodzire is our next one, which slips in right there, so so maybe if you really want to complete a master set, maybe, because I think I pulled two of these as well, uh, I could be wrong on that one. If you want to complete a master set, maybe opening multiple of different products is actually the way to try and get some of these cards. Potentially, this might be something to keep an eye out for in future videos. Didn't think it, but hey, possible. So that basically, ones I've just dropped in there now, basically everything in the main set. We're getting pretty close now. We are actually getting pretty close. 
Uh, we're still looking for that Grusha to complete off the trainers. Until I find something built in battle boxes that I need to slide in. But now we're into our art rares. So 196 Sprigatito. Slide in right there. Uh, 199, so you are going, 99, you are going to be right there, my friend, Fletchinder. And we've got 202, which is going to be here, because that's 203. Now we're going 216, um, 14, oh, we already had a Tinker. <laughs> and here I was saying that I thought I knew which ones I had and didn't have. So, we already got a Tinker Tinker, so that one's going to go off to the side. All right, 2.22. Hold that thought. Nope, it's passed. Thought I was gonna sneeze then. 2.22, 2.22, where are we? Uh, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. 22 goes all the way up here. All right, so that's the end of our art race. Now we've got our full art, so where are we? 2.42, so 40, 41, 42, Annihilate. That's where you're gonna live, my buddy old pal. Uh, 244, so you're only two over. Oh, Squawkabilly, that's right, I forgot to take you out of the pile. I knew I had you. Uh, 247, and then we're going... Like this. <laughs> I still honestly can't believe I pulled this card. Love it, love it. It's, they're, they're hard to pull these uh, illustration rares, but I'm glad I got one. Uh, 72, 71, 70, 69. I don't know. And I just said that. What? I mean, what I'm alluding to is 269, but the fact that I just said that. 74, 75, 77. And that's where our next one goes. We're doing okay. We're getting there. We're doing okay. So I'm still looking out for some more product. Still need that building battle box. Uh, build, build battle stadium. And uh, a couple of those single packs. I think I'm going to be looking around on eBay for those single packs. But look, we're getting close. Still need a couple of reverses there. There are a couple of... Um... Oh, hang on a sec. That should be Artisan. I'm pretty sure I've... I'm going to have to check that one. Um, if I've got it, I'm going to slide it in there. And I'm not going to say anything about it. I'm not going to update it. I'll just slide it in. You'll probably notice that in the next video, but that's Squawker Billy. And then, yeah, we just got the Grusha, and um, I was right. I do need another non hollow in that, but I think it's just because I've, I've missed it. For some reason, I've, I've done a dum dum, and I've just missed it. So, I'll be back with you all on the next video after I find myself a built and battle stadium. It looks like everyone's out of stock and they're not uh, available until. Uh, oh, I was going to say. I was going to say next month, but by the time I post this video, it's going to be this month in July. And I'll be back with another one. Um, so again, look, I'm going to say the same thing I do every time. If you like this video, and you love watching how we can complete this set, and all the different cards that I need to complete master sets, give me that thumbs up, please. It means a lot to me. I enjoy it. I enjoy watching those thumbs up climbs. Not only that, but even just the views. I just like watching the views climb. And leave Leave a comment, subscribe, etc, etc, because remember, don't forget, if you watched these videos before, you'll remember, but if you haven't seen any of these videos, I'm going to give away, when I reach 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours, I am going to give away a full booster box to one subscriber of whatever that set is at that time, when I reach those two. That's basically when I get monetized. Or at least get the chance to be reviewed for being monetized. But that's when I'll get, as soon as I can reach those two, and I need subscribers to do that, that's when I'm going to give something away. And whatever set it is at that stage is the booster box I'm going to give up. So thank you for being here. I really appreciate your time. If you've made it to the end of the video, you are the OG, the GOAT. I'll see you on the next one.